Hello Prime Coders, welcome back to Prime Coding channel. So recently, TCS started sending the interview dates. Yes, the interview dates is announced for all TCS tag qualifiers who given TCS uh, code with the exam in January itself. Okay, so it took time, but not a problem. Now you have interview dates. It may be you have interview tomorrow, day after tomorrow or in the next week. But yes, interview is started. So we will be discussing uh, interview experience of today. Okay, a uh, student whom I mentored personally uh, gave his interview today only. Okay, so we will be covering that as well. Before going to it, I will be uh, covering uh, the mail which... The people who got placed or who got the interview opportunity might got the same. Okay. So, dear candidate, although it's confidential, that's why I hide all the information. So, uh, greeting from TCS campus recruitment team. Please uh, inform that we won't be able to reschedule. So, you if you got the interview dates, you can't uh, think that your interview can be rescheduled. We thank you for applying for opportunity with TCS code beta hiring and would like to invite you for the Per, uh, person interview process which is face to face okay face to face clear this is an exclusive invite letter which you can show on the gate and you can get into the DCS office right away so if the people who are from code vita I will highly recommend you is your interview would not be an easy one okay this interview is very close to my heart because I give his n number amount of time to him so that I can mentor him on a point so that he can ace the examination so I will let you know that conditions too okay so this is the mail uh, which you can receive right after uh, the qualifying uh, TCS code beta examination okay or tie examination so rounds how many rounds are there now Rounds of TCS do vary campus to campus. Somewhere it is only in one shot. Otherwise, there are two rounds. First of all, technical manager round is there. And who is qualifying? Candidate told me it's an elimination round. If anyone is not able to solve or not able to perform well in this particular section, they are not sent to the HR round. Okay. So, yes, if you qualified this, then only uh, they will send you to the HR round where HR questions is there. Clear? Very clear. So now, interview experience, let's talk about it. So TR, introduction, simple introduction where you need to talk about yourself. Explain the code you solved in code beta. Now this guy, I also ask the same code. And the best part of his interview is, all the questions that I ask to him, all the questions that I ask to him, same question came here. Is that a coincidence or what? But yes, experience speaks a lot. Okay, mentored n number of people. TCS is one of my expertise nowadays. Like I, can, I have spent more than 500 to 600 hours of studying how they ask interview questions, what a kind of question can be from from a resume and something. So yes, it is one year of experience I can say. So solved in code vita. So I asked him the same question. He said uh, both of the question was recursion DP based question that he attempted and we discussed in the mock interview as well. And the same question was asked to him in the interview too. Okay, so write code to insert a node in a linked list. So I asked him, although they asked him how to delete a node in a linked list, which which means they are talking about singly linked list. But in the interview, I asked him, can you delete the node in doubly linked list? Because if you see, uh, if you see the interview experience of TCS and QT, they most likely to ask you the link list problem. And the catch is you need to write code. You need to write code on white paper. And that code should not have a single syntax error or any kind of error. If you have any kind of error in your code, let your interview went very well you will be demoted to right away role which is just beside that which means if you if they think that you are qualified for digital role they will demote you to the ninja role and if you talk about the NQT prime role to digital role clear very clear so white paper they will be give you and you need to write code uh, in cognizant they are provide uh, like you need to write code in your laptop but here they will be giving you white paper so explain Q with a real world example 
ओके वी हैव अ इन इन लेंस लाइक आई कैन से इन डेप्थ डिस्कशन ऑन डेटा स्ट्रक्चर्स एंड एल्गोरिथम वेयर आई आस्क हिम टन्स ऑफ क्वेश्चंस ऑन दैट आई बिलीव दैट ही वाज एबल टू एक्सप्लेन दिस प्रॉपर्ली ओके सो एक्सप्लेन बीएफएस एंड हाउ अ क्यू यूज्ड इन बीएफएस इन द इंटरव्यू आई आस्क हिम लेवल ऑर्डर ट्रैवर्सल एंड हाउ यू कैन इंप्लीमेंट दैट सेम क्वेश्चन अगेन ही फेस्ड राइट अ सुडो कोड I also to ask him, can you speak about the code? How you can implement? So he was able to. Although he is a very good programmer, he is a specialist. Okay, a specialist programmer on code forces. Yes, if you have heard this platform, which is a great platform, it's a specialist there. So I already told that you need to look over on non-linear data structure a lot because. you first of all cried code beta where the question was based on recursion dp then there are high chances that your question in the interview also would be easy but in the non linear side they may ask you traversal questions and yes all the feedback which i'm giving to you should write it and study on it okay all that traversals like dp approaches like uh, memoization tabulation approaches and famous dp trending questions like a house robber climbing stairs frog jump and uh, finding subsequence unique grids this kind of famous dp question recursion based question you should able to like validate sudoku or cake uh, queens step problem so yes these kind of questions please try to prepare clear so explain your project which is a basic uh, resume based question explain the endpoints uh, of your api why they ask is because his resume was totally uh, like dense with fast api project okay where he created many apis and a uh, lot of back end work was there so yes this question i also asked to him like endpoints middleware so how you can create it what do you mean by it also explain the model that you used he have a machine learning project too where you have not mentioned a lot of things but fortunately he studied all of these models and stuff and i told him to study about the performance metrics because if you have a machine learning project in your resume you should justify the performance metrics that you are using because every model let's say if you are called classification model or regression model have their own best performance metrics existed so you need to uh, study that too okay so the next is managerial round what is the state uh, status of your placement in the college which is a basic managerial situation based questions what uh, companies have you been selected in uh, since you are selected in cognizant he selected in cognizant as mindry why you chose tcs and what is your approach for solving problem in code beta okay because the code beta problem was not that easy that's why whatever question you got if you forget please try to recall particular question and see what approach that you implemented and why and what can be the optimal because in the previous year i found that the optimal approaches was also discussed in the interview okay let's say you use only recursion at that particular time and you only memoize it and only memoize the recursive approach then in the interview they can ask you about the tabulation can you tell me the tabulation approach or can you optimize the approach which you implemented in code vita so this kind of uh, questions you can totally expect okay now hr round which is a qualification round after the tr mr if you are able to qualify that then only you will sit into hr so basic cosh questions on about hobbies are you comfortable with night shifts uh, relocation questions about uh, education background what is your strengths and weakness so these are the very uh, to the point question that you need don't need to go but that part is when i asked him about the linked list and more theoretical question it was not that proper at particular time what he has is good communication skills yes he has a good communication skills and he just did a path which we gave in the mock interview itself and he is able to nail it okay that's why when he gave me like 116 i wrote on 117 that have you nailed it because most of the question covered so it is easy peasy isn't it so we right away have a call and we discuss about everything okay so yes it is the latest tcs uh, uh, code vita interview experience that you should go through so interview experience so resources would be interview experiences that you should look over of all tcs uh, digital you can find me my on my channel as well like if you write tcs digital interview experience you will be able to find it okay so subject questions okay so what all subject questions uh like subjectual questions from oops sql dbms you need to go through because in his case the interview are revolving around dsa but it may be in your case the uh, situation would be different resume specific his resume was filled with the unnecessary thing which i 
told him to remove the right away so that his resume looks simpler and more easy question can be formed and as he was a specialist programmer most of the questions he will be able to crack it and the project questions also covered and HR and MR questions covered I also recommended him to go through this particular crash course a playlist which is available on YouTube for free this quality no one can match in the paid courses as well so you can go this is totally enough for any kind of interview if you are sitting into any service based company it's my word to you and mock interview after preparing all of the resources which I mentioned if you prepared and you know that you are able to answer you need to check yourself and it's my bet to you if I say if I say that you will be uh, acing your upcoming interview then definitely otherwise I will be giving you tons of feedbacks I either it could be me or any of my team members but yes all of our uh, great qualifiers okay so they will mint you i will also there so it's a total comprehensive package of more than 90 minutes okay we'll sit for 90 minutes and we'll talk about multiple kind of things okay so let me show you the resources the resources for uh PCS and many more interview because what I will recommend you is if you are going to sit for any services based companies okay so most of the companies do have the similar kind of interview experiences so let me show you the resources before having look on the resources this is a prime coding website which will help you to land your dream company or your upcoming interview opportunities just come on mock interview if you want resume review or any company that you are targeting okay it could be digital role ninja role or anything this is the platform where you can test yourself Again, I repeat, I am not here to sell you any courses. I just know that if you are good in speaking skills and if you are good with all the subjects and uh, the resume, then it's my job to help you out how you can place your answer well in the interview. Okay. And yes, if you want to make your parents proud and if you want to uh, like give a good investment, this is for you. A few hundreds of bucks, like 119 and 219, and you can get worth of rupees 9 LPA, 7 LPA job right away. So, this investment is very, very low as considered to the price or return of investment that you can get. Okay. So, the links would be in the description. You can just go and watch the crash course if you have interview upcoming days. And after uh, going through all the notes or all of the things, this is the platform where you should come and check yourself. And if you talk about the resources, all the resources are available for free, like zero rupees, zero rupees. You just need to claim like thesis and QT, all reflexive one place thesis, top uh, 30 aptitude questions and much more. And if you're aiming to ace the TCS and QT exam, mock test is already created. And if you are coming from the link, like from the discover page where all the creator is listed, if you come from here, you will be able to apply Aditya 20, Aditya hyphen 20 coupon code or any of the creator. Okay, let's say you came on my profile. So you can apply Aditya 20, Aditya hyphen 20 coupon code straight away to get a 20% discount. Okay, so you can see Aditya hyphen 20 coupon code and you will get straight 20% discount, which no creator will provide you because this is a very uh, thing which I just removed all my affiliation so that it becomes a strong coupon code and I can help all of my community member okay so I will request I will request all of you that if you are new to this channel please consider subscribing it and please please share with your friends so that your friend can also follow the genuine resources they don't need to spend a penny anywhere I will be taking and holding your back with free contents okay study from my free contents and end your preparation with the mock interview and the next opportunity which you have interview, you will be acing it. It's my bet. Okay. So we'll meet you with a new video soon. Until then, take care.